everyone, this is Mayube and welcome back to another manga haul. If you're new here, hello, how's it going? I hope you're doing well. It's been a while since I did a manga haul. This is a combination of the manga I bought and read for the months of July and August. Let's get right to it. First is One Punch Man. I have volumes 11 through 20. Right Stuff had a birthday sale and One Punch Man was part of those bundles. The One Punch Man bundle was the only one I got because the other series I was planning to get were out of stock. I also got volumes 11 and 20 on Amazon. I recently reread volumes 1 through 10. I also read through volumes 11 through 20. I watched the first season of the anime years ago. I really liked season 1. I haven't seen season 2 yet, but I know what happens in the season since I read the manga first before watching. If you're curious when season 2 begins, the story continues in volume 8 of the physical copies. Based on what I googled, the second season ends in chapter 84, 85. In the physical copies, the season ended on volume 17. So far, I've been enjoying One Punch Man. I like seeing the new characters and seeing all the heroes from different classes. I like the arc I'm currently in, but it's not my favorite. Here's Watukoi Love is Hard for Otaku Volume 3. I've been enjoying reading the series. I like the romance. I also like some of the video game references mentioned in the series. The series can be relatable. I've only seen one episode of the anime on Amazon Prime Video. I don't know if I should continue watching or wait for volume 4 that's coming out in October. Next series I have is Naruto. I bought the 3-in-1 editions during the Books A Million sale. I heard about the sale through Viz Media's website. They posted a blog about some summer sales. I have volumes 1 through 9 and 22. I also ordered volume 10, but that hasn't come in yet. Hopefully I get that volume soon. I recently finished watching the anime, both Naruto and Naruto Shippuden. It was long, but I still enjoyed it. I was in the mood to watch a long series, so I finished watching Yamira Patissiere months ago, and so I started watching Naruto afterwards. I enjoyed watching this series, so I decided to read the manga too. I read volumes 1 through 9, and this covers part 1 of Naruto's story. I did skim through volume 22 a little, and it has some good moments in there. I like what I read so far, and yay for no fillers! When I watched the anime, I followed a Naruto watching guide. The guide tells you what episodes you should watch and skip certain filler episodes to watch later. I thought the guide was helpful. I'll leave the link in the description if you want to try watching the show. Finally, I got Beastars Volumes 2 to 4. I personally enjoyed watching the anime on Netflix. After watching the anime, I decided to read the manga. I liked the story and the characters. I'll definitely pick up more volumes. There's some scenes in the manga that were not included in the anime, but I still would watch the anime again and watch the second season whenever that comes out. And that concludes my manga haul. Thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoy the video and see you guys in the next one. Bye!